Hey, what is up you guys? It's Megan and today we are back with more of the Sims 100 baby challenge Now I know that a lot of you guys were sad because um, it took me a while to bring this back I felt like not a lot of people were watching it But then I did a vote on my channel to see if I should bring the Sims back and an overwhelming amount of people said yes Like over 300 people said yes and only like 10 people said no So I figured I would bring it back see if you guys wanted to keep watching it now, for those of you confused, this is not the very first episode of my Sims 100 Baby Challenge episode. I will put a link in the comment section if you want to start from the beginning. Right now, um, how many kids do we have? How do I see that? Right now, um, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight babies. Um, so one of them is no longer living with us because, you know, we had to make some room. So just one of them moved out and she was really mean anyway. And it's actually one of the baby's birthdays, homework complete. It's both of their birthdays actually, they're twins. We have Michelle and Tiffany. So I'm gonna do a really big recap real quick just in case you know, you're know you new here and you don't actually feel like watching the other episodes. This is Noah, he's about to be a young adult. And then this is Hunter, he is about to be a young adult as well. Um, they are not twins, they are you know just brothers. And then we have the triplets here. We have Brooke and then Victoria, but I accidentally put an L in her name instead of an I because I'm, you know, I'm really good at this game and I just haven't fixed it. <laughs> Sorry. And then over here we have, um, this is Nicole. Nicole is a sporty one. Right now she's working on her skills to become, oh, I, well, I guess I was working on her. Oh, wait, I'm the wrong person. Um, let's see, I guess I was working, yeah, her social skills, they're up to level four, which means her homework should be all good. Whew, and then, um, you know, uh, which was which, uh, I think that Victoria was supposed to be the one who was kind of, um, nerdy and like, you know, really good at life, <laughs> always overachieving, and then we had Brooke here who was supposed to be like the outdoorsy child who really liked to be outdoors all the time. So they're all doing their homework, all the people are doing their homework, because if you don't know the rules of the 100 Baby Sims Challenge, if we get our children up to an A student, then we can give them birthdays, and then, you know, start making more babies. Now, right now, we have our main matriarch, Aaliyah. A matriarch is the woman who is the head of the household. She is the one who births the baby. She is working out. I decided I wanted her to start acquiring this new skill. She's only level one because I figured like she's put on quite a bit of baby weight and I don't think that she's very happy with that. So I'm just going to have her work out a little bit from now on since all the boys could start working for money. And also Aaliyah, she has a level 10 painting skill. So that is how we mostly make money is by her paintings. We just moved into this house. This is going to be our first episode inside of this house. I hope that you guys like it. Our old house was really cramped and this one is nice, new, big, spacious. I really like it. I'm going to have to add two more baby rooms, but we only have $98. So we're going to be juggling around. Maybe I'll paint a masterpiece, see what I can do to add like a second story to this house. Just to see if we could get any more um, rooms. So yes, this is the new house. The mailbox is kind of in a weird spot. Sorry, try not to try not to think about it too much. Let's put the roof up. What? Roof up. All right, so there we go. That's the that's our house. This is our 100 baby Sims challenge and I we still have a long way to go. I saw somebody doing this challenge and it took them over a year to complete and they never finished it. <sighs> so I'm going to finish it. We're going to try even though we took like a few months of a break. Here we go. So I'm going to have Aaliyah work out. As I mentioned before, she's just running on the treadmill. I don't know, I I just figured, like she put on a lot of weight from the um, the babies. So I don't know, I just figured she might wanna lose that. But actually what we need to do is we need to maybe bake some cakes. Okay, so we're gonna build, break a hamburger cake and we're going to cook a chocolate cake because we're working out and what's better to eat than cake. <laughs> so let's check on the kids here. We're all in a pretty good mood. We're all in the green, so that's good. Um, I've learned really quickly that having a household full of eight people gets out of control super fast. So that's never fun. So we have everybody socializing. They all have really good relationships with each other. Let's check on their schooling to see, see, okay. So Noah, he's an F student. That's not very good, but he finishes homework. Let's see if we can have him do more homework because I know they can do extra credit work. Nope. There's no homework there. So whatever, I guess that's as far as we can go with him. We have Hunter who is a D student, his homework's complete. And then all the girls are pretty good on their homework. Um, complete, complete, complete. B student, A student. Oh, so look, see our outdoorsy sim. Um, 
Brooke, she is almost an ace and we can almost make her a teenager. We need to start bringing more money into this household if we're gonna have more babies. I still, like, this is not the finishing house that I want. I still want it to be much bigger. What are you doing? Are you okay? Are you, are you doing all right? Okay, so we're baking the cakes now for our little babies because, you know, they deserve a nice little birthday cake on their birthdays. So I'm wondering, we're also gonna have to, you know, give them little makeovers. Oh my god, she's in the, why is she in the, why is she in the red? Oh, she's angry. Um, caught with Bib from school event. Well, that was a bit embarrassing. What? She was caught with a Bib? Yeah, okay, go try to calm down. She didn't even go to school. What? What's her problem? Okay, so, yes. Put that away. So, yes, we have everybody completing all of their homework. Okay, so one of the cakes is complete. We're gonna add some birth- We aren't gonna add birthday candles to it. I don't want anybody to accidentally blow those out since we just aged them up one at a time. Still wanted to give them their own cakes. Let's have- Hunter go fishing because that's kind of his skill and let's see if we can have Noah collect some collectibles so we can sell those um, harvest harvest because we still don't have a lot of money so we need to go on a little scavenger hunt collect some stuff I have some pots back here that we can use to grow they're actually the um, the Easter pots or from the Easter event Do you guys remember that the spring event so I have those, um, we're gonna try to grow something awesome in them, something that yields a lot of money. I'm gonna have to Google that and see what I can plant that's the best. Oh, there's a lot of stuff to harvest around here though. Alright, so he's gonna have at that. It looks like it's time for the babies to level up. Level up? Age up? <laughs> Alright, so here we go. M more choices. Age up. Alright, so first we're doing Tiffany. Oh god, where'd she go? Oh. Okay, so Tiffany has a buzz cut. Okay, so- Oh, so when this happens, I have to close my eyes and pick it at random. So my eyes are closed, and I'm gonna count down from five, and I'm gonna pick a trait. Five, four, three, two, one. Nothing picked. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Pick. Okay, so rambunctious scamp. I- Okay, that makes sense. So pick a trait. So on this one, I do, I hold this, one, two, three, four, five, stop, and then we go over, one, two, three, four, five, lazy, that seems like it conflicts, rambunctious scump and lazy, okay, well, that's what the cards had in favor for, which one is this, Tiffany, <laughs> who is going to be getting a makeover, um, no, now we got to age up this little one. Please move out of the way. Go here. I know you're really excited. Go, go away. Stop. Like, she's just making all the kids just not like her. <laughs> Age up. Okay, so let's see. This is Michelle. Oh, why is she wearing makeup? Okay, so here we go again. One, two, three, four, five. Also a rambunctious scamp, they're twins, so that kind of makes sense. So we're gonna start at the bottom for this one. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Squeamish. Okay, um, so that's cool. <laughs> None of these traits make sense. So let's go ahead and have Michelle come over here. We're gonna give her a makeover right now um change appearance and then we are also going to have oh gosh she's still so angry stop calm down why are you so mad look at her okay so oh and good now she's in the way again we just want to change our appearance okay move please tell me they're about to get along okay good i didn't want them to do something that was like go here like can we like take a cold shower just relax just relax. Unwanted sibling? What? No! <laughs> okay, so we have Michelle first. Let's see, why, what is she doing? Okay, so Michelle. Michelle, she's rambunctious and squeamish at the same time. Why is she wearing a hat? I really don't want her to wear a hat. All right, Michelle. 
this is a very cute hairstyle um rambunctious and squeamish so yeah she could be kind of girly but kind of like really excited about life at the same time take off your makeup you're a child or should maybe this maybe a braid would suit her better actually um i kind of like the pigtails none of them have pigtails right nope just just her just michelle okay so that'll be good for that i like her outfit like i already like what she's wearing i'll change it up a bit though because i know whenever i don't you guys get kind of oh let's see like socks there we go we don't want any socks um remove all that remove those because we don't want we just don't okay let's see can we give her some white pants that's kind of cute i really like this cat sweater guys um, I don't really want to change that. Or actually, I could change the color. That's really cute. Um, and then she needs shoes because she's rambunctious. Maybe we can find her a pair of sneakers that doesn't look like they're a pair of hiking boots. Those are nice. Um, do we have a good color? A color that matches her cat outfit? Okay, these kind of match. Okay, so that's good. Formal. Oh, God. Where do you plan going looking like that? Exit. Mm -mm -mm. No, no makeup. Sorry. No glasses either. No, I don't have anything against glasses, guys. I wear glasses, but jeez. Let's see what we have. Um, this kind of matches like her hair. It has like the little flower right there, but are there different options? I don't really like the polka dots. Oh, that's cute. Okay, that's perfect. Let's see for outdoors. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, so she can wear makeup for this because that's adorable. This is really cute. Okay, so let's see. Can we get some brighter sneakers? Something that, like, accents a little better? Oh, perfect. Oh, and I like this detailing on this back here. It's like a mesh. That's really nice. So, sleep. No, like, she's gonna get really hot if she sleeps in that. So, why is she wearing glasses? Like, you, your, your vision is perfect, Michelle. Stop trying. Oh, and also take off your makeup. Why is that? Oh, God. Okay. So, for sleep bottoms, that's kind of weird. That's like underwear. She's a little girl. I don't want her to, like, sleep in her underwear. Oh, cute. Matching PJ set, but, like, she's still wearing socks. Stop. <laughs> Who wears socks to bed? Okay, so for her party outfit, can we have, like, a styled look for this? Oh, that's cute. But, like, a different color? No, I don't like that. <laughs> I actually don't like it. Oh, this is cute. Oh, this is so cute. Okay, yes. Okay, that, that's perfect. That's perfect. And for swim, again with the sunglasses. Bye, bye. <laughs> okay, for swim, um, I don't really like these bottoms, but like she's a little girl, so maybe they're okay. Let's see, do we have like a squirt? Oh, these are cuter. Okay, so for swim, that'll be okay. Now it's time to make over Tiffany. She has kind of a masculine um, hairstyle. Which I'm not a fan of. I'm really glad that The Sims added the option to kind of make everybody, you know, um, oh, I can't change the options. That's weird. Oh, they're for teens and older. Okay, that makes sense. But like, you know, to make trans um, Sims, I think that that's really cool. But Tiffany, I really just want, I want as many girls as I can because, you know, this is the 100 baby challenge. We need as many options for the next matriarch as possible. Okay, so for Tiffany, I kind of want to leave her hairstyle dark, but like we only have one blonde in the family. So maybe I'll just lighten up her hair a bit, but they're twins. So her hair is going to be black. I do like the pigtails. These are really cute. Um, and they're kind of like her. So, okay, they, sorry, I never complete those. They're kind of like twins. So that's okay. Um, let's see now for her outfit, her everyday outfit, what she's lazy. Um, that's, that's cute. Is that a real, this is a real Sims thing. So, see, okay, so I got the kids stuff pack. I haven't been able to look at it yet, obviously. Oh, this is cute. I really like this. There's different designs to, hmm. Maybe we should just give her this shirt. Maybe we should just accept it. Just accept it. Okay, that's okay. <laughs> um, and for the pants, what do we want to do? She's lazy. I don't know what lazy pants, like these would be considered lazy pants, but like, do I want her to look that lazy? Like sweatpants? Okay, now I'm just being lazy because honestly, it's the 100 baby Sims challenge, not a let's play. So I need to stop trying so hard. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. 
They did a really good job on the styled looks though. Like this is really cute. Okay, inverse swimwear. We'll give her this bad boy. Okay, so the twins are done. Uh, I, I don't I don't know if I like that. Oh, this is really cute. Okay, I'm sorry guys, I'm changing it. Yeah, that could be her style. That's cute. That's good. I'm accepting it. I'm accepting it. And Michelle, come here. You guys can take a selfie together. Um, let's see. How do I do that? Do I do this? Take photo with Tiffany, because they're twins. They're excited that they've just become children. Oh gosh, do you want to go back to working out? Aaliyah, I know you do. Work out. So let's see. We gotta get them a cute picture to go together. Fire! Stop! Everybody stop. Everybody stop. Fire. Fire. Where? Oh god, it's probably here. It's probably right here. Oh god, there it is. Do you guys see it? Oh god, okay, so we need everybody out of the house. Whew, alright, I'm not ready to press play yet. Um, go here. Go here. Everybody, evacuate the household. Go here. Exit out the fire because we don't need anybody stopping and looking at the fire. Just, just leave. Just get out of the house. Go here. Yes, okay, so... Um, go here. Don't look at the fire. Okay, he's he's not even concerned. They're not concerned about the fire. Okay, so exit and we're gonna have the mom put it out. That's how that's how things go. Okay, everybody escape. Oh god, okay. This is not the time. This is not the time. <laughs> um Oh I can't zoom out. They're just gonna be really close together. This is not the time for a picture. Okay, exit. Bye. Thanks for coming. Stop, 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 okay. Stop freaking out. Extinguish. All right, super mom here to save the day. Put the fire out, you can do it. Took a picture. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Please don't catch anything else on fire. Oh, I'm super bummed out. Oh look, she's super satisfied with her work that she just did. Okay. Oh good, we received 84 freaking dollars. That's 200 dollars to replace. Okay, who was scavenger hunting? We caught a fish, so we could sell that. We could sell this apple. Okay, so Hunter was the one scavenger hunting. Quality, normal. So let's actually, let's see, which of these sell? Oh, okay. So for one, we could sell for 50. So we're gonna plant these. Plant, plant, plant. I know in our last household we didn't really keep up with the amount of um, the garden, the tending the garden, which we needed to do. But, you know, we all make mistakes. And now we have more people equipped to take care of the garden. So I think it'll go, okay, what's this? Okay. So now we have to replace this, that sucks. Why is... Um, throw away okay so it looks like whoever was mad about not ha or about having another sibling is no longer mad about it um they all seem to be doing okay oh look they're having a group discussion out here all the kids we have so many kids but she what is she doing why does she look so mad okay why does it say that michelle is still a baby throw this away don't play in it definitely don't play in it let's see plant all these what's our gardening skill i know it's all right Gardening skill four. So we get this garden under control. That's gonna be a good way to make money since these sell for 10 each. Um, run with chest out. Oh, confident. I was like, that's kind of, that's special. Oh yeah, <laughs> that's cute. Okay, so let's see what else we have going on in today's episode. Stop fighting. Oh, having all these kids is gonna be kind of hard. Because they're just all going to keep fighting, I bet. But good. We have them all working on their skills. Mental. She's at level 4. Motor 1. That's probably not good. She should probably work on her motor skills a little bit more. 
They should all have really good social skills growing up with so many siblings. Wow, okay, so let's see. Four for mental, okay. Maybe I should get another one of these and have them all learn about mental stability. <laughs> I don't know. What are you doing? He's literally kneeling right here at this curb doing makeup homework. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Is he almost done with it at least? Oh god, he almost got hit by a car. What is he doing? And let's actually see if we can get Nicole to paint a masterpiece before we go. We're gonna do a classic painting or realism. I think classic is where the money is. I can't remember. So we're gonna sell these cots. We don't need them. Okay, let's see what we can whip out in this short amount of time before the episode ends. Anything? Any ideas, Aaliyah? Oh look, they're watching My Sims or something, but we need to turn this off. We need to watch a different channel. Actually, she's not pregnant right now. Um, the problem with the TV is every time it's on, like, the kids keep on watching cartoons, and I think watching cartoons influences the babies to be girls, and we aren't allowed to do that. But, like, all the kids keep on trying to watch cartoons. I don't know what to do about that. Okay, so it appears Aaliyah has finished her painting sell to a collector. It's gonna be 800, so that's good. I'm gonna go ahead and have her get started on another one. Large, so we can get a little bit of money under our belts whenever we start to have to pay bills, because that will not be fun. And then the boys, do they have jobs or? Oh, let's see when they all age up. Oh, Hunter ages up in six days. Um, Noah ages up in, I guess, six days. The girls, they age up in five days. And it looks like the new girls have 12 days until they age up. So what about Aaliyah? Where is she at? She's going to be an elder in 14 days. So we're going to hopefully need one of these girls to age up or either that or we're going to have to take a break in our quest. I don't know. I think that we kind of already do have to take a break because there's so many kids here and none of them are young adults. And the household is the household is full. Like we're pumping out babies like crazy, but I don't know. Maybe we should just take a little break, live life for a bit, get everybody kind of where they need to be, get some more money before we continue to have babies. Maybe we could afford to have Aaliyah have like two more rounds of kids or one more round. It just depends when everybody ages up. So probably just one more round. I know whenever she gets pregnant, she won't be aging. Okay, so let's see. Sell to a collector, that's also a good chunk of money. And we have two thousand dollars. That's a that's good. That's a good amount to have. Um just do another one. <laughs> Ooh, something I do want to get though. It appears I just saw something that said like Michelle acquired a motor skill, which is good. And it said that she could acquire more motor skills by playing on the monkey bars. So let's see if we can buy some monkey bars for the kids while they're at school. Um, monkey bars. How much are they? 800? Um, these are cuter though. They're like 900, but they're a lot cuter. But do I just want plain monkey bars? No, these are nicer. Um, let's see. There, because we have a lot of kids, guys. Is she gonna go to school? Why is she, she's still kind of tense. Oh, she has to use the restroom. Well, at least she can use the restroom at school. Bye. Have a good day. And now it's time where Aaliyah is just alone in general with her thoughts. Um, let's see. Okay, so this one's, oh, that one's the, about the money of the monkey bars. That's okay. The pink bib. Victoria's setting up for new kid at lunch. She sees buy some pink in his lunchbox. Is that a bib? The kid smiles nervously and claims that he got his baby sister's lunch. Um, the bib fobs it out where everyone can see it. Just pick it up or just ignore it. Pick. Ooh. Ooh. This is foreshadowing. Do you guys remember whenever, um, do you guys remember when earlier in the episode it said that she was mad because she got caught with a bib? I feel like, like that was an error and I was supposed to get this. So we're going to ignore it so that we don't get an angry trait. Once it's almost over when the class bully notices the bib on the floor, you can't wait to find the little baby who dropped it. But the new kid says it has nothing to do with neither the, but the new kid says nothing and neither does Victoria who may have 
Just made a new friend. Okay, see, that's a better outcome. That's what I'm looking for. So I think that's a good spot to end today's episode, right where we started working out. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Again, if you guys want to watch the rest of the baby challenge episodes, I will put a link to the playlist of that in the description and also in the comment section so you guys can click on that and easily watch more. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you guys are as excited for The Sims Return as I am, and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye! Hey guys, thanks for watching all the way to the end of the video. That really means a ton to me. Now, if you guys enjoyed the episode and enjoyed all the guys in the video, you can subscribe to each one of the Proper Idiots down below in the description, or even our Proper Idiots channel where we upload new content every single day. Run, run. So if oh. I hurt you- Oh, man, no, you're mean! I can run away! Can you, can you fix yourself now? No, I can't fix myself! <laughs> Are you serious? Are you serious? Are you serious? <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> you gotta be I wanna just- <laughs> So silent. I hate you. I hate you. <laughs> you. <laughs> We're also locked. <laughs> Dang, he killed me. I threw C4. Oh god, he knows I'm here. He's gonna try to flank me. Yes, he he's trying to flank me. I can't. Yes! Now, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a like on it to let me know that you liked it, and leave the secret hashtag phrase which I have written above me. Um, if you leave this hashtag phrase, I will know that you watched all the way to the end of the video and you will automatically become part of the Cool Kids Club. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye!